Mi nombre es José Morales Crispín, and I'm the Hispanic Community Outreach and Engagement Coordinator for the Franklin County Sheriff's Office. So even though it's a really long title, like Hispanic Community Outreach and Engagement Coordinator, pretty much it's community relations. I am the middleman between the Hispanic community and law enforcement. Mm. I'm the person that works on bridging that gap. So before working for the Sheriff's Office, I was a high school Spanish teacher with Whitehall Jalen High School. And while I was there, they realized that they have a big Latino population. So we created a heritage class and they focus in how to use our language to benefit the community through volunteering, through service work, and we did just like a, like a food drive and, and a clothes drive. Mm -hmm. They started collecting stuff that we were going to donate into a shelter. And then I saw that you guys had the poster that you were taking that trip, and so that's how I talked to the kids and said, hey, why don't we go ahead and send this stuff to El Salvador? And for them, it meant so much because not only they were helping our community here in Columbus, they were sending stuff back to their homes their family, so it was something that impacted them in a really positive way. So they had shirts, they had hygiene products, uh, pants, baby clothes, jackets, literally a lot of stuff. We had approximately six or seven bags in a few boxes. Yeah, I remember it was a lot. Most of the donations came from you guys. First of all, I'm a teacher. Mm -hmm. I care about my students, I care about my community, so I think that a role like this one is giving me enough resources to be able to make a change and an impact in our community. Nice. So funny story, I was just like a regular client, like everybody else. And then since you guys have a really good coffee and it's a like welcoming environment, I started coming here. People started to get to you know my name, the drink that I wanted to. And even though it's a little creepy, my wife started getting jealous because I was coming here so often. So I started bringing my wife and it's, we established that relationship in which I became more than a client. Like it felt more like a family. And that's how I was able to bring my job from the sheriff's office and what can we offer and work with Coffee Connections. Just last year, we hosted three events here with Coffee Connections, and it was Coffee with the Sheriff, in which we brought different community leaders from the Hispanic community, just for a conversation with our sheriff. How we can work together, how we can benefit the well-being of Latinos. So Coffee Connections became that hub in which we were able to come in together as a community in an environment that we feel comfortable. Um, we also hosted We With a Deputy, in which we were able to bring some of our therapy canine unit dogs. So we had kids reading out loud with the deputies, with the dogs, they had free books, so it was really awesome. And we also had Jingle with the Months. So we bring the same canines which from our therapy canine unit, and it was just like a meet and greet for them. They had uh, Christmas outfits and we had a Christmas tree. And again, it's, it's an environment that you feel comfortable, you feel welcome, and you feel at home. Plus, you guys have good coffee. I actually see CS keep partnering together because I'm, I'm not gonna lie, it's a good team. Mm -hmm. it's, it's being able to have that place, again, when you feel comfortable, mm -hmm. so start being able to bring more programs here, yeah. start bringing more of the community and having us work together. So one of, one of my main focus for, for the future is to be able to not only listen to the concerns of the Hispanic community and what can we do about it, but actually be proactive and do something about it. Not only living in that conversation with just stays there and it doesn't come back to it, we can actually create programs and initiatives to better our community and, and do something actually about it. Okay. Good.